The mortar bombs, although old, were still deemed alive. They were deactivated by the bomb disposal unit. The dropping dam level exposed them in the mud. Police are investigating the origin of the weapons, believed to be foreign. We can't say with all certainty that we have I mean, cleared the place of all the mortar bombs that we have found here. Uh, all I can say is that we are continuing with our investigations. Our search are ongoing. We will from time to time visit this place to make sure that uh, it is cleared of these uh, dangerous uh, devices that we have found in the place. The Stralizia Dam is a popular recreational area in the suburb. Residents are concerned that there might be more bombs hidden under the water. The blast radius of a mortar is about 300 meters. And we are very, very, very concerned what's happening here. The other fact that obviously that uh, makes it more difficult is that we are not experts in this type of field. We do not know when a bomb can go off or not go off. Can it go off in the sunlight? Can somebody just pick it with a broomstick? Can somebody just pick it up and then it explodes? So though, those are the fears that we, we, we're living with. And obviously uh, all the residents in Namisia Street, which is just at the bottom of this, uh, is very concerned because, I mean, if you read in the newspaper this morning, it's exposures up to 300 meters. The police have asked the public to stay away from the dam until the old clear is given. The dam is not fenced, but no end signage will be erected. Zolani Moya, SABC News, Judenhaeg.